Just filming the almost empty parking lot in front of me. Birds have taken over. In the evening you can see rabbits and hares running around here. For about a year ago, maybe somewhat longer, well one and a half years ago, I was working later shifts in this area and normally I was free from work at nine o'clock in the evening and then I had to go home so normally 9.10 or 9.15 I was on my bike and then during summertime it was light outside but in spring in fall normally it was dark and then you actually could witness hares and rabbits running around in front of the bike and jumping or jumping to the side and normally this parking lot was where I went over well almost every morning and every afternoon or evening and it was full of cars normally but as you can see there's only one car there Not sure what I'm hearing, but sounds like a drone. Propellers of a drone, but it could also be something else. The only car that was parked here just left it was a dog owner, female, walking there. Her dog, and well, she left dog in the back of the car. Also, the drone enthusiasts who were flying their drone here are gone. Only thing is left me and some birds having a food fight. chasing each other, making life hard, harder than it should be. It's between the crows and the seagulls. Some can be clearly seen with something in their beaks. Like this one, for instance. Not sure what it is, but it's flying with it. Chased by other birds. And in the distance on the parking lot, they're still uh, chasing each other. And I can see some ducks swimming in this pond here in front of me. So I'll raise the camera 
There's some water. Well, continuing my bike tour. And we'll be continued by making a U-turn. Sorry for the noise, the cable popped out of the camera. The cable of the power supply. I had to plug it in again. Well, let's go on this parking lot I was filming. Let's bring a visit to the birds. <coughs> of course, they will not stay put there. They will be leaving. At least that's what I'm counting on. The birds will not stay where they are. Some littering going on on this by on this parking lot. What juice was in. Never ever seen this thing empty. I have been cycling in this area for 15 years, but this is actually the first time. Well, ending up at a construction area. Something is going to be changing here. Let's see if we can get a little bit closer by. And it seems that I actually can go here, a temporary road. And also what looks like a temporary bus, bus stop. Bus, bus, bus stop. Bus stop. Bus, bus stop. Well. All this area is revitalized. Zernikalan is modernized, upgraded, whatever you want to call it.
don't know how far I'm gonna get over here. It's actually the bus lane. But uh, for the time being, there will be not that much buses over here. Part of the road to my left is ripped out. But I understood it has been renewed, but also there has to be cables re relayed or replaced, removed and laid somewhere else. And actually with the schools closed down, they decided to get these works done earlier. Normally it would have been done in summertime, in the weeks that the schools were closed, but project was planned differently and pulled towards now. And of course that's a good idea. Well let's see what's going on at the Feringa building area. There's a new building being constructed here, Feringa building, Feringa Gebouw. Last time I went here there were a lot of pile drivers. Well busy not, but putting the foundation in of this building. Well, it sure looks like they dug a humongous hole in here. You can clearly see all the concrete pillars in, which form the foundation of this building. Also there the steel reinforcement rebar is placed on that side that has to be done the same way. It's going to be a huge building, it's going to stretch from over there. To there. I moved a little around to the other side of the big crane. And also there's construction over here. Raising the camera to have a good better look of it. Not sure that's succeeding, but but it's slowly getting somewhere. But now all the groundwork is still being done, and actually, when the building is going to be built itself on top of it, it's going to be done quite fast. And the building over there, with the black windows and the white, that will be torn down in future and will not be needed anymore. And this building, which is constructed here, is replacing it. Well, on a pair of stairs to a building, you see a much better view over here. That's my bike, by the way.
also film this wooded area because this is being cut down in future. But this is the main area where I uh, want to be focusing on. Like a nice view from the top. Big crane. Let's go this way. Let's see what's going on here. Probably not much. I hope to get a little bit closer, but that's not something that's going to happen. Well, nice to have a look a little bit from above, from the building site. Because you know what, when the building is standing there, the view will never ever change again. Until they tear it down, of course, but always nice to see when things are being constructed.